is all said and here you see the public viewing gallery right here at Sri Hari Kota at the Satish Dhawan Space Center. You see huge crowds that have thronged this entire gallery to be able to watch the launch in person. Yes, in some time from now is where uh, the PSLV C-57 Aditya L1 mission will be launched. Here is that very screen where the live pictures will also play out in a short while from now. But uh, in the skies, you will be able to see that rocket take off and move into space. Uh, of course, we understand how Aditya L1 mission will be executed where uh, the spacecraft uh, will uh, try and attain the lowest orbit of Earth after uh, it um, exits the gravitational force and the gravitational pull off the Earth, it will slingshoot uh, and uh, with the help of the propulsion system propel towards uh, reaching the halo orbit of Lagrange 1. That point that has particularly been chosen for the very reason that uh, the gravitational force of the two large masses, that is Earth and Sun, uh, should be balanced out and be equal to the centripetal force that the smaller mass, that is the spacecraft, requires to be able to be in a stable position and consume minimal fuel. It will perform experiments for over five years. Here we are in the scorching heat and uh, sun <laughs> shining right above us as uh, we are set to explore it through the Aditya L1 mission. You see how people from several parts of the country have taken their seats on the gallery and they're waiting for that very moment when the rocket will launch. Just quickly take a look at this screen. ISRO putting out the live pictures of the rocket PSLV C-57. Uh, ISRO Chief S. Somnath monitoring as all our scientists now. Uh, watching every moment, remember, detailed uh, dress, uh, rehearsal. Students, space enthusiasts, those who gather in huge numbers to watch the Aditya L1 mission launch right here from Sri Harikota at the Satish Dhawan yes. Space Center and fighting the scorching heat. Here it is the ambition first sun mission that ISRO is attempting. Let's get a quick voices from those sitting here. I know it is very hot. But are you waiting for Aditya L1 rocket to launch in some time from now? Yes, I'm so excited to see that launching. What do you know about this mission? Aditya L1 is uh, going to the sun for researching on that one. Wonderful. Wonderful. And you hear these loud cheers. Loud cheers building up in the crowds as uh, everyone gearing up for the very ambitious. Aditya L1 launch, our scientists there at work as uh, this is the viewing gallery where uh, this large audience that is gathered to see the historic feed in person uh, are witnessing the live pictures here and a quick check of these young budding scientists in the making. What do you know about today's mission? Uh, uh, it's a very successful uh, mission. I am think I am imagining that it will it will successfully landing on the sun. You think that we'll be able to perform all the experiments on the sun? Yeah, sure, ma'am. Why is it important? Why is this mission important? Uh, this is our India's uh, project work. We should want to do that uh, project. Work. You want to be a scientist when you grow up? Yeah, sure, ma'am. All right, so you see the enthusiasm and those who are gathered here shortly from now we'll be able to see the rocket take off in the sky and the spacecraft where live pictures will be relayed by ISRO. And there you see the successful launch of Aditya L1 right in the skies of ISRO. You will be able to witness the liftoff of PSLV there in the sky. Yeah, L1 that just went into the skies as it has now exited the skies of Sri Harikota from the Satish Dhawan Space Center. There you see Aditya L1, a successful sun mission and India's first sun mission that has just been executed right after the success of Chandrayaan 3. Here you see the loud cheers that are coming in right from here. Excited crowds as India attempted its first sun mission Aditya L1 and it will take all of four months
months <laughs> until it reaches its designated position. Isro will keep putting updates. But there you see how it has separated. Isro putting out live pictures. Or as our scientists are observing.